Hizi gari ni za kijana ya rais wa taifa la Kenya George Ruto. Na hakuna askari wa traffic ambaye anaweza iguza. Manifest a controversial matatu owned by President Ruto's son George Ruto has caused a quiet stir in your Sinigishu County. For the better part of last week, this matatu by the name Manifest or rather in the street language Ganya with the name Manifest has been trading a quite good from last week in which it made a comeback trade on Twitter where George Ruto posted a picture with golden medals posting in front of the controversial Ganya code manifest. Some Kenyans are saying that this is just like President Ruto's son George Ruto just showing Kenyans the middle finger or rather like saying he doesn't give a damn. Digging deep into manifest and understanding why did this matter to, you know, uh, became the better part of trade of last week and today on a Saturday? It's because this matter to was accused of violating countless traffic rules. Wala kuifanya kichochote. Madereva wana nguvu zaidi kuliko askari. Gari haina hata jina, haina jina yako. Gari inakuja hapa ina reverse kwa roundabout. Askari wanaangalia tu. Other people are arguing that, you know, because it's President Luto's son, you know, in Africa, if you are a son or a daughter of a president, your business or any other property affiliated to you uh, automatically becomes untouchable. And there's this video I made about the owner of Matatu Association of Kenya, and he was saying that even if you are a son of a president or a son of a politician or a powerful businessman, you must follow traffic rules. And in load, there must be equity in terms of people following, you know, rules. Na hakuna askari wa traffic ambaye anaweza iguza. Manifest made its way to Sugoi after having a mighty stop at Eldoret where everyone was amazed by this matter too. And it caused a quite of spark in the heart of Eldoret town or rather the city of champions. The Maratu was the center of people's attention in Eldoret. Other people come in helplessly with phones to take pictures and selfies as the Matatu locked with good music, its golden finish design with amazing graffiti. And, you know, for the better part of today at night in Twitter spaces, George Ruto is trading because of this picture that he had just posted in front of this controversial Matatu. Do you think like George Ruto should do Matatu business but follow rules and his vehicle should have NTSA inspection? What do you think about this picture? And many Kenyans are thinking that it's just George Ruto trying to savage Kenyans after this Matatu by the name Manifest traded for the better part of last week and today at the better part of today's evening made a quite good comeback in Twitter through the photo that was shared by George Ruto.